Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, today in this video, I'm gonna tell you how to fix iPhone Air speaker not working after iOS 17 update. Have you ever encountered a situation where there is no sound when talking with a friend on your iPhone? In many cases, this problem is caused by your iPhone Air speakers not working properly. So today in this video, I'm gonna tell you how to fix this issue. First of all, you have to turn the volume up. The most basic check in the volume is the volume. Sometimes the volume set to zero and we jumped around other strings to solve the issue. Press the volume up button on the left check the volume or swipe up on the home screen and you will see the volume there. Simply if it's in minimize then simply maximize this to that. Then step number two is remove the cover. The cover of an iPhone can also block the speaker. In this case you won't able to hear anything from it. You, and it usually happen when you buy unreliable third party accessory. You can remove the cover from the mobile. Now check the whether the speaker is working or not. After removing the speaker and you are still facing the same issue again and again and it is not working then you have to restart your iPhone. If any application bug or voluntary mem memory is creating a problem for us the speaker you can restart the device. It will refresh the device, clear the memory and solve various issues. For restarting your device simply you have to go to your settings. Go back and tap on general, scroll down and tap on transfer, uh, tap on shut down, shut down your iPhone and then restart it after 15 to 20 seconds later. After restarting your iPhone, you are still facing the same issue and you have to reset all settings. If the settings on the device are disturbed, the speaker might not stop, might stop working. You need to adjust the setting, but it is quite difficult to figure out where the mess happened. Therefore, it is better. It is better to reset all settings. It can all resolve various issues with the software or device. Once you reset all the settings, I reset to the factory settings just like a brand new device. Simply open your settings, then go to your general and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap on reset, tap on reset all settings, enter your passcode and try to fix your issue. So guys, if this video helps you, then make sure to like and subscribe my YouTube channel for upcoming videos and thanks for watching.